The merge, it's close, it's exciting. <laughs> Ethereum's all over the shop. Is it actually gonna happen? Right, so the merge has been on the roadmap of uh, the Ethereum blockchain uh, project's development um, since its inception in 2015. There have been several uh, delays uh, in the past several years, and um, there has been sus suspicion of the time of the merge. But um, um, based on the conversations with um, investors and developers, uh, they are more confident than ever that the merge will happen in the next couple of months based on a couple of reasons. And firstly, uh, we've seen uh, the merge on the test net uh, being completed with without major technical glitches, which is the promising sign that shows the merge will actually happen in the near future. Uh, secondly, right. if we look at the derivatives market, in particular, the Ether options market, we are seeing a lot of investors who are betting on a price hike during around the time of the merge. So those, uh, those two things kind of indicate that you know, um, there is a fairly high confidence level of, for the merge to happen in the near future. Well, it, it seems like investors are positioning for this to happen, right? They're, they're trying to get in because they anticipate further upward movement in Ethereum. But then there's a school of thought that when it actually happens, we'll see a crash. Explain that logic to us. Yeah, so, um, so you know, like, um, there is a saying in the crypto space, you know, sell the news. Um, at the end of the day, I mean, we have to remember that crypto market is a highly speculative market, and a lot of hot money, uh, speculative capital, you know, will be flowing from the large-scale uh, investors into the market around the time when the merge happens because they are in search of uh, arbitrage opportunities in the time of high volatility. And another reason might be that you know um, there might be other potential technical uh, difficulties or glitches. Uh, happening after the merge, which would discourage investors to invest more, to put more money into the, into the project. So those are the two major reasons, um, you know, based on my conversations with uh, investors and core developers behind the project.